Welcome. This orientation video is for all drivers loading and unloading at the West Fraser Log Yard in Edson, Alberta. When entering the log yard, you will pass a security shack before approaching the scale house. Be sure to obey all posted speed limits and use caution when approaching the scale house. The Edson Log Yard only has one scale for weighing in and weighing out. If more than one truck is waiting to use the scale, priority will be given to the first to approach and will alternate as required. Each entrance to the scale has two sets of sensors. Approach the scale slowly. Once you pass the first sensor, the scale will zero. You will then be notified to proceed. Drive onto the scale at no more than five kilometers per hour until your truck is completely on the scale and between the two sensors. Apply the air brake and exit the cab carefully using three points of contact with required PPE and checking for slippery conditions. All drivers are required to wear the following PPE. Hard hat, safety glasses, high visibility vest, CSA approved footwear, and appropriate work attire. No shorts. If you need to use a washroom, there is one located inside the scale house. We will now review the weigh-in procedure. Enter your truck number manually using the provided keyboard or click the numbers on the screen using the provided mouse. Select your name from the driver database. Select the type of load you are hauling. Select the type of logs, pine, spruce, or a mixture. Select source. Enter your TM9 ticket number. Then review the load information. If correct, click yes. The printer will automatically dispense two load tags, which will need to be stapled on all four corners to each end of the first log on the passenger side of your load. If your load is a sample load, Three additional tags will be dispensed. Sample tags are required to be stapled to one log on each bunk, or if tree length logs are loaded, stapled to three larger butts facing the cab of the truck. Security cameras are located both inside and outside the scale house. Now that your load has been properly marked, you are ready to proceed off the scale and towards the DRAP station. Cell phone use is not permitted in the log yard at any time. Please use your radio to communicate with log yard personnel. There is no smoking allowed in the log yard at any time. Before exiting the scale, radio the operators on the designated yard frequency and inform them of the following. Who you are, that you are leaving the scale, type of load you have, and whether or not you are a sample load. The operators will then instruct you on where to go to be unloaded. Exit the scale slowly. Once off the scale, the maximum yard speed limit is 30 km per hour. When approaching the DRAP station, there is a road crossing with a stop sign. Come to a complete stop before proceeding to the DRAP station. Keep in mind, heavy equipment always has the right of way on site. Proceed to the DRAP station. Approach the DRAP station slowly, under complete control, and centered. Complete a visual check as you approach, ensuring the protection arms have been returned to their open position before entering the DRAP station. Exit the cab carefully with all required PPE. Release all protection arms using the manual pin lever system. Be careful to avoid any pinch points. In some cases, the wrapper may get caught in the load. If this does occur, use a pike pole to free the wrapper. Once all wrappers have been removed, you may return the protection arms to the open position. Do a visual inspection of the area for debris and ensure protection arms are back in their fully open position. If protection arms are jammed, do not back up. Backing up will cause damage to the arms. If there are any problems with the station, please notify the operators. When leaving the DRAP station, look both ways for pedestrians before pulling out of the DRAP station. Lights and gates have been installed to help notify you of any pedestrians in the area. Proceed to the designated unload station given to you by the operators earlier. Proceed only when safe. If you are being unloaded by the main crane, you must leave your truck and go to the trucker's booth wearing your PPE. There is a radio located inside the booth for contact with the operator if needed. Do not return your truck until the crane has completely unloaded your truck and the grapple is between the legs of the crane. For all other offload stations, please stay in the cab of your truck. If unloading at the hot deck, approach and depart with caution. There will be other equipment in the area. Once offloaded, proceed to the scale for weigh-out. 
Be cautious of pedestrians at crossings and stop completely at all stop signs, looking both ways before proceeding to the scale. Approach the scale slowly, exiting your cab using three points of contact and wearing all required PPE. Enter the scale house, return to the computer, and enter the following, your truck number, and the yard unload location. Now review all your load information. If correct, slide ticket into printer. Ensure it is positioned correctly, then click yes. The printer will automatically stamp your TM9 card. Once printed, remove the white and yellow copies from the ticket, being sure to keep them bound together. Review and confirm all information has been filled in correctly. Remember that your TM9 ticket is required to be signed before you leave the bush and arrive at the West Fraser Yard. These are government controlled documents and failure to properly complete the form can result in a fine. Deposit the yellow and white tickets into the way out slot next to the printer. Keep the green and red copies for your own records. Once you have exited the scale, you will need to enter the designated cleaning area before leaving the yard and traveling on public roads. Full PPE is required when cleaning off your truck. Be sure to clean the following. All loose debris off the truck, trailer, and mud flaps. Any rocks wedged in your tires. And all reflectors and lights on your truck and trailer. This is also the best time to inspect your truck and trailer for damage including broken lights, tire pressure, and that all straps are secured. If at any time you require assistance, use the radio frequency 150.455. This concludes the West Fraser Log Yard orientation video for the Edson location.